So if you're trying to lose one pound of fat per week, you need to be in a deficit of 500 calories per day. If you want to lose two pounds of fat per week, you have to be in a deficit of a thousand calories a day. Now, sometimes you'll lose a little bit more than, you know, that two pounds of fat. Sometimes you can lose three pounds of fat and sometimes you'll lose a bunch of water weight. I've had guys lose like 10 pounds in their first week. So it depends. And I've also had some people who are like, you know, 300 pounds who could lose like 30 plus pounds in a single month. And I've had it happen many times before. However, once things kind of level out and you stop losing water weight and you're just losing pure body fat and you start to get more into the long term of your fat loss journey, you're going to be losing anywhere from 0.5 to 1.5% of your body weight per week if you're trying to lose weight. The biggest principle is reduce the amount of oil that you use and increase the amount of protein that you use and make sure that the meat sources that you're using are lean. So instead of using chicken thighs, use chicken breast because it has more protein, less fat. Instead of using a quarter cup of oil, just use one tablespoon or teaspoon of oil. It'll taste 10 to 20% less good, but it'll make you feel way better because instead of feeling bloated and heavy and tired after you eat, you're gonna have a ton of energy after you eat because you're eating just straight protein and carbs and no fats are gonna weigh you down. And what I've noticed actually with African-Americans and Somalis is that the low fat diet with higher carbs higher protein and more frequent feedings works insanely well. 